What is the fastest and the easiest screen capture technology to use? In my opinion, it's Snagit. I'm using Snagit 2023. I've been making screen capture videos since 26 and I have a YouTube channel with thousands of videos on it, all done with screen capture technology. What I like about Snagit is that you can literally make a recording in one go. It can record your webcam as well, but then you can upload the video into YouTube or into the specific video repository that you get with Snagit or save it on your computer with one button click. In this video, I'm gonna show you some of those options and just how easy it is to make a screen capture video. Okay, really hope you like the video and if you do, please like it, please share it, please comment on it and of course, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. So the technology that we're gonna use is Snagit 2023. You can download it and test it out for free. I've been using screen capture technology since about 2006. And for me, this is the easiest, the fastest, and the quickest technology to share. Often it's just one button click. So I'm gonna do a screen capture, and to do a screen capture, I just need to click on this button here. Screen capture opens up this kind of um, recorder here. I choose video, and I'm gonna choose region. I'm gonna mark an area of the screen and I will use my webcam. Now, interestingly as well, we can actually choose different types of shapes when we use the webcam. And for this one, I'm gonna use a circle, but notice that I've got lots of shapes. This is a pretty sophisticated tool. Now, all I need to do is jump over to whatever it is I wanna screen capture and begin to record it. So just for simplicity's sake, I'm gonna kind of introduce my website to you. So I'm gonna come over to my website and now click on that recorder. I've got it on video. I'm gonna click capture and I just hold my mouse down and mark the area that I wanna record. Okay, and now I'm ready. Okay, now you will notice also that I come on the screen on my webcam there, you can see me there. And all I need to do is to click on this button and that is it. And I'm just gonna do a quick video. This is my website, teachertrainingvideos.com. Lots of free videos on it. And if you want to sign up to the newsletter, at the moment there is a free 14-part course in using technology in teaching and learning. I'm going to click on the pause button. And I can go back and obviously continue the recording. But if I'm finished, I just click on stop. That is it. Incredibly, that video is now recorded. And perhaps even more incredibly, I could now share that video with one button click. And that's what I'm going to show you after we played the video just to check the quality of it. Just one super quick thing, if you see this video before the 18th of January 2023, I will be doing a free webinar showing you more of the Snagit features. Snagit actually does loads and loads of other things. That link to sign up to that webinar is in the description below. So let's just quickly play that video and see how it's come out. This is my website, teachertrainingvideos.com. Lots of free videos on it and absolutely perfect. No problem at all with that. Now watch this. First of all, I'm gonna show you how I would save this video on my computer. I would come over to here. I would click on file. I would click on save as, and I'll save it on my desktop and I'll just call this TTV, teacher training videos one record okay simple as that so one click and that has been added onto my desktop now i'm going to go play the video from my desktop but then i'm going to come back and show you how in one click i could then share this onto the basically a video repository it could be youtube it could be screencast.com etc So let's just jump over to my desktop. There's the video, let's click on it. There it is. This is Play my it. website, teachertrainingvideos.com. Lots of free videos on it. Absolutely brilliant. Notice it's got my cursor recorded as well. I've got my webcam here in the corner. I've got a high quality video that's an MP4 file which I could now upload onto Moodle, onto Blackboard, into Google Classroom, etc. Now, I'm gonna show you the same process now but uploading the video onto the internet. And again, it's just one button click.
Now actually you can do many, many things with Snagit. It's a very versatile tool which you can use for making infographics and worksheets and text grab and also for image capture. So if you want to learn more about all of the options rather than just the screen cast option, then click on the video that's on the screen now. I'm going to show you now what I consider to be my favorite feature in Snagit. Watch this. I'm going to click on share link. Okay. And that is going to upload the video onto a specific repository. And you'll notice that the video is already ready. And all I need to do now is click on get link and then share that link with my students and they will be able to access the video. Because it's so easy, watch this. I've literally just shared that link then, as I said, as soon as I upload it, the link's available to me. I'm going to paste in that link now as if I was a student. And this is what I'm going to find. Here's my video and I can play that video. This is my website, teacher training videos, and here I can even comment on the video. So this is really, really useful. So I might say, for example, this is great. Can you, for example, can you move the webcam? Let's imagine I wanted to check whether or not you can do that. Okay, and the answer is yes, you can. Okay, and then I can submit that, okay? So now you've even got the option here of building up a conversation. Imagine how you could be using this in education. You've got a video that you've created and you want all the students to comment on that particular video. This is a great way of encouraging a conversation. But this could also be great for teachers, uh, teacher meetings. It could often save meetings because perhaps you make the video and then the teachers can all comment on it on the side. This could really be a time saver and you can see why I like working with this particular tool. Now, some of you might be asking for a more sophisticated screen capture tool. And if you are, I actually made a course of using Cam on how to use Camtasia 2022. And I'll put the link on the screen now to use that, to learn about that technology if you want to use that technology. Now, I know many of you will want to share your video in YouTube. So if you come to share, if you've got a YouTube channel, come down to YouTube and the first time you will need to connect your channel, okay? That is, you will just need to sign in with your Gmail account so that Snagit is connected. I've already got mine connected here, as you can see. I'm gonna upload this video here. I've got my title, TTV1 Record. I click, simply click on Share, and it's more or less the same process. This video is now being uploaded onto my YouTube channel, and the link is ready. I'm gonna click on Get Link, and let's do the same as we did before with the screencast.com. Let's now look at that link on YouTube. So let's open up a new browser window or a new tab. I'm going to click on share that link and there is the video. This is my website, Teacher Training, on my YouTube channel. Of course, the difference is you can't quite comment in the same way that you can when you're using screen or screencast.com because you can't kind of add the comments here on the side. But as, as you know, you can comment below. So that's another option. Again, you can just see how easy it is to get the video onto your YouTube channel. Okay, really hope you liked that video. And if you did, please come over to teachertrainingvideos.com. We have a section on screen capture, which includes lots of videos about using Snagit. You might find that useful. And don't forget, as I've said before, you can sign up to the newsletter. You get up late, updated with all the webinars, the blogs, the online courses, and of course, all the latest videos that I put out. And at the moment, we're offering a free 14-part video course in using technology in teaching and learning. You can find out about my paid courses here at the front as well and if you scroll down to the bottom also you can access my blog i'm going to leave some more videos on the screen now about snagit and thank you very much